Good morning, guys. We're going to start it out with a dancing baby. <laughs> He's so freaking cute. <laughs> and, and a dancing Lori Lee. This boy, I, me, no, I, I don't dance, so don't ask. I, yes. Or Iron Man. Like, You're asking me if something matches. Well, the same person that wears socks with the sandals. <laughs> well, yeah. I know, right? Ready? Ready? Stand up. Oh, <laughs> mommy pants the baby. There we go. Pants for a hat. He looks like the flying nun. Pants for a hat. You should make him fly. Anyway, today we have to uh, turn his car seat around. That's the first thing that I want to get to. So, how do I turn this down? Can't find the remote. Oh my gosh, okay. Isn't it funny, guys? <laughs> I, I passed the TV like two times. I could have just hit the button on the TV, but no, I had to find the remote to do it. You guys, he's saying hi differently now. He's starting to take his hand and like open it up like he's chomping something. Like, rah, 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 rah. hi. <laughs> All right. Time to turn the chair around. It reminds me of Gloria Estefan. Be like, turning the chair around. I won't do that again. I Sorry. All right, I gotta hurry up because he can't stay out in the sun too long. He'll turn into bacon. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh my goodness. What are you doing? <laughs> you are crazy. <laughs> we turn our back for one second. I come out here and he had grabbed a roll of toilet paper and he's TPing the front room. <laughs> <laughs> he, he snuck out right between us both. I know. With a roll of toilet paper. Oh my gosh. You're worse than the cat. This is our bat cave because we got to keep it cool. But I'm gonna open these just for a second Did to show you me? guys. I know here. Well, actually, let's do it this way so the lights on me. Okay, so Lori Lee went. Lori Lee went the other day and she got like three items. You guys saw two of them yesterday: the the mug and the baby shirt. And then she went and got. This and this is the last one ever made. See if I take care of it. Well, of course. And, ooh, I, I'm nipping. Ooh. <laughs> anyway, that was embarrassing. <laughs> Highly inappropriate. But thank you, baby, because she went. She got this stuff for me. It's so awesome. And it was going to be a Christmas gift. <laughs> what <is> this? <laughs> <laughs> it was gonna be a Christmas gift, but I'm like, wait a minute, it's hot outside and all his clothes are dirty, so here, just take this. <laughs> and you can see my tat and my muscle. <laughs> or at least my tat. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're having focus issues. The lens is so dirty that it's focusing on the crap on the lens. That is crazy. Alright, there we go. We're back in business. <gasps> We're forward facing. See, now he's got leg room. <laughs> so, see, that's what I was talking about with his hands. See that, guys? Isn't that awesome? Chomp, 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 chomp. Now you gotta learn to squish people's heads. Like, ah. You're a berry picker. And it's sweet? Sweet mm. and sour at the same time. Oh. Mm. It's really good. No. Oh. No, that was horrible. That was horrible. Well, it's not horrible. It's awesome. It's. Mm. Yeah. Sweet and sour at the same time. That was not sweet, that was all sour all at the same time. Do you see the hurt mouse baby? Oh, That ant's like all up on him too. Poor buddy. Okay. I don't want to touch him. Just, yeah, just toss the whole thing up there. Poor baby. Get out of the sun. Get out of the sun. There you go. Now a bird can't come eat. And die in peace. Yeah, poor guy. I mean, the humane thing would have been just to squish and put him out of his misery. <laughs> but that's just, that that seems cool, but he's just going to suffer. He's going to suffer. For I've never been to this part before. It's just a little faction off the trail. Is that a word, faction? I probably it's used in the trail. wrong context. There's a little trail that heads off the road behind us. And the bathroom is way over there, and I have to go pee pee. Why don't you just add to the to toxic algae? There you go. The world is your toilet. <laughs> wow. Ah, the first duck to experience the bird, or the, the bread crack. Holy crap. Oh, the fishies are eating it too. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. You gotta crumble it up into little smaller pieces. And wow. 
You guys see the fish? I'm surprised a lot of these fish don't have like one eye and maybe yeah, and five eyes. Algae. Yeah, kind of like the Simpsons. Did you hear me try to quack? <laughs> Is that what he did? <laughs> quack. Yeah, the bird fell underwater. That one, that white one right there, he's an aggressive little guy. Yeah, he's the one that kept biting me that last time. Mm-hmm. Sorry. Just trying to give you the crumbs. Yard sale! Look. <laughs> oh, it's just for you. Hey. I know. Look, I got the same one, and mine really doesn't work. That is so cool. This is way newer than mine, I'll tell you that. They've got they've got this, and then they have that, that other holiday over here. I love this guy. He goes, hey, where are you going? I see you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yard sale finds. Stuff that Lori Lee got at the yard sale. First, we found this wonderful bait. Oh, no. No, not you. Uh, the... How you doing? <laughs> she went and she got this awesome piece of art for $2. She got this awesome tablecloth. It's actually round, but we can use it in here on this table for makeup. Uh, and still be festive. Right, yeah, for uh, makeup cover in here when people are doing makeup. She got this. There's kind of a story behind this. Well, I have one that I've had for like 18 years, and I think it's kind of busted, but I wanted to get them a friend because they match. So she got that for 25 cents. And then she got all of this freaking paint. A dollar. She paid a dollar for the box, and then each one of the paints was a dollar. Just kidding. No, she got all these for a dollar, which is awesome. The blacks and the grays might end up missing when the haunt comes no. around. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's telling on me. Are you telling on me? He's like, Daddy's stealing paint. All right, so I've got one pallet taken care of. All the stuff's in the back of the truck. This is stuff that I'm donating today. Uh, guys, Naomi Grossman, Pepper, uh, American Horror Story. Possibly a little snag. She was supposed to have uh, contacted me yesterday, and we were supposed to set something up for today, being Sunday, and she hasn't done it yet. So, she's really, really busy, and it's kind of my fault, because if I had gotten on the interview and everything before and watched uh, American Horror Story, got caught up on it, then I would have had the interview. Where's my keys? Oh, I'm sitting on them. That's uncomfortable. I would have had the interview taken care of a while ago, and she's just like really busy right now, so I'm going to keep trying because this is really awesome because she's in this huge project right now. And here we are at the donation station. Wait, what is this? Please remain in your vehicle until an attendant is available to help you and keep your arms, legs, and appendages inside the ride until it has come to a full and complete stop. I, I asked him what, uh, I, I, why do I stutter? I asked them what the weirdest items they've ever seen donated were, and I got three responses from the, the lady. She said, lingerie, because that's just kind of weird. Would you want to wear somebody else's lingerie? And then the guy, oh my gosh, the guy said, a personal riding machine. <laughs> and then he followed that up with, uh, I'll say fake phalluses. Uh, I'll, I'll keep it as, as PG as I can. That's crazy! Ew, why would you want somebody else? No, no, just no. Okay. Wow. Wheatgrass. <laughs> I just gotta get like the appropriate like wheatgrass juicer. Oh wow. Butter lettuce, because a little bit of butter makes the bitter lettuce better. The test is almost completed. As soon as the test is completed, you will be instructed to remove your arm. Please continue to sit as still as possible. Ooh, I'm only fair. Uh-oh, wah, wah. Awesome artwork. That's pretty cool. Do you guys have the same idea that I have? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Ah! <laughs> So, cleaning up the stuff underneath the carport, and I gotta get this in here. <laughs> ah! <laughs> get it, baby! He's drooling. He's having such a good time, he's drooling. Uh oh. Oh, here we go. I guess I don't have to make the sound effects, do I? <laughs> 
probably not gonna shoot too much here at storage, but I will tell you this much. Does this not look like Ace Ventura Pet Detective, right? Right? Wow. I need to cut my hair again. I was gonna try and pull an Ace Ventura. Too dangerous at this point. <laughs> But just in doing that, you guys get my drift. <laughs> we were walking by, and Lori Lee made the comment, it's like, it sounds what like somebody's that? dying. I thought it, maybe it was a goat, or maybe a cat fight. <laughs> I said, oh no, it's a trumpet. Really bad trumpet. <laughs> hey, practice makes perfect, right? Looking at the bright side. Now, if they've been playing for 10 years, then there's a problem. <laughs> I'm sure the neighbors love them. It'd be like Squidward with a clarinet. That's what it sounds like. <laughs> hey guys, out for a walk. I wasn't going to vlog anything because it wasn't interesting. And then it got interesting because it sounded like somebody died. Oh, psh. That's probably why they stopped playing, because they listen to you critique them. <laughs> and then they're going to come out and shot them. What'd you say? Psst. Hey guys, come here. It's time for a cock. Spooky Norris. The beginning of your vlog was very serendipitous, as I also came to that conclusion earlier this week, too. Yeah, something's got to give. Um, it, it, it's really hard. I don't like doing side work after work, so, you know, I have to make some decisions. The ice bucket challenge was pretty cool, guys. Lori Lee looked like she really enjoyed herself. <laughs> yes, she did. Maybe a little too much. Andrea at Rose Grills. Can't wait for the hunt this year. Ah, yeah, me too. I'm, I'm really excited. And that was one of the main things today, getting the driveway clear so that I can start getting panels here. Uh, tomorrow is, well, tomorrow when you see it, but today for me because it's like 2.11 in the morning. Uh, today... <laughs> We're going to be uh, hopefully getting that scrap truck emptied again so that I can start throwing panels in it. MSM Michael 99. Holy crap, Halloween is right around the corner. I remember you taking down the haunt last year. It feels like yesterday. <laughs> it really does. Yeah, I really wish I could leave it up year round. Then I wouldn't have to worry about grass and probably wouldn't have to worry about a bunch of the damn trees back there either. LJ Mike 1204. Watch out, you don't get mugged. Oh, 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 and Troy and the Rocks. Oh, I get it. It's so weird. Sometimes I don't get things when you guys post them because I can't remember what I did yesterday, much less today. And and then I read this and it's like, oh, it all makes sense when I read it right here, right now when I'm doing COC. So that's, that's an amazing thing. Lisa A. She does this times three. Tuning Caster, say, Troy, sorry I haven't commented in a while, but don't worry, still watching since around vlog number 400. Oh my gosh, it seems like ages ago. Anyway, I was wondering what company you use for your business cards. Um, I think uh, it's uh, Vistaprint. I'm pretty sure it's Vistaprint. Speaking of which, I've got like five left. I need to reorder. So thank you for reminding me. Star Wars Shack, looking forward to your haunt build. Now you said which I could help. Do you mean wish you could help or which you can help? Meaning like you can help. Just let me know. Post that down in the comments in today's vlog. Branson Haunted Hills, it really sucks and bums me out uh, when we can't go to something like a vlogger fair, but good advice. We need to make some changes to make things happen too. Yeah, see, nothing changes if nothing changes. If you guys just keep doing the same thing, then nothing's going to change. And if anything does change because you don't initiate change, it's usually not a good thing. Bad things happen that way. Oh my god, oh my god, that graphic looks great. Made me so happy. I can't wait to see the cock graphics. I'm looking forward to your build videos too. Um, thank you, and um, um, thank you so much. Uh, I know I said I was going to give a shout out of all the graphics uh, yesterday. Um, I'm probably going to do that tomorrow now because it's just way too late. I started talking about it being late and I started yawning. It just sucks. Oh, and uh, COC graphics. I want to try and shoot for that tomorrow also. Uh, Steve Lewis, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, 73 days left until Halloween. I know, it is crazy. I remember like the last three years, I get down to the 90 day mark and I start panicking. But you know, it's, like I said the other day, is I think I'm, I'm more relaxed this year because I know that it'll get done and what doesn't get done, eh, oh well, it's still going to be an awesome haunt and we're still going to rock it out because that's what we do. We take what we're given 
and we freaking weld it and duct tape it and nylon wire tie it and bailing wire it and electrical tape it and we make it into this awesome freaking haunt thing kind of jason christopher 77 ha 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 the water bucket challenge was priceless guys let us know if the guys you called out do the challenge okay first of all uh yes uh, zach and jeremy ball did do it uh, but there's a drought in California, so they did things a little different, and hats off to them. Really freaking awesome. Uh, I wasn't able to donate. I was just able to get the word out a little bit more. So I, I think I've started this, this whole Haunter thing. Oh, look. I made a chart, guys. Look, here's the chart. So it started with Hellmouth and Bloodshed Brothers, Steve's Haunted Yard, and Scott Colling. Scott's going to do his tomorrow. I talked to him. Uh, Bloodshed Brothers nominated Dan Doble, Ed Roberts, and Scott JHMDF. Ed Roberts has accepted the challenge. I don't know about the other two yet. And Steve's Haunted Yard had Goth Gloom, uh, Dead with Dave, and God's Flesh. And I know that Goth Gloom has already done it. And they have, or he, yeah, they have uh, called out Diablo 85 and Woodland Haunters. So this, my friends, this is what it's all freaking about. This is awesome. It's kind of like a football thing, right? Jason Christopher also said, referring to the beginning of this vlog, go for it, Troy. Oh, and you also said, friggin' Santa Panda at 325. Did I really? I'm going to have to go back and check that. Adam owns, I try those chips that taste like coffee. I like them. And yes, I was talking about the head bob in the beginning of the videos. All right. I, I almost felt like the old blonde joke of putting, you know, spikes in my shoulder pads. How do you kill a blonde? I don't know. Wow. Too much. Too tired. Happy hunting, guys. See you tomorrow. I'll be like David Letterman. That's some bad hat, Harry.